the number one objective over anything else is that we are still uh, facilitating learning and whether this was done in the classroom physically or whether this is done online the objective remains the same um, and that obviously doesn't go away until a student um, you know leaves our care so some of the things we put in place are we have got a strong tutor system where we can help students um, get ready for, for a more kind of online experience um, and of course all of our teachers are very aware of what um, they, can, they, they need to be doing in order to uh, help our students succeed. So the way a lot of teachers are doing it and what we recommend is to give them sort of bite-sized chunks of tasks uh, in the absence of live lessons. Live lessons are really difficult because of time zones. So when a teacher gives them a bite-sized chunk, maybe it's a couple of lessons worth of material, Students have been um, have found it very good in that they can then feed back and say, oh, I didn't really understand this. And we've got a few different ways in which we can maintain feedback from students and obviously from us, from the tasks they've done as well. What I would say from my perspective is the most positive thing is that students are not bound by certain times. So they can put it into their own uh, schedules, really, as long as they are organised, um, which is a massive thing for any student, especially once they go to university. Uh, they can do it with a, 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 sort of a sense of autonomy, really. It does require an extra element of motivation. It really does. So it's about being organised with your time, making sure you're able to plan your day and really be motivated. It's a similar challenge that students have when they go to further education. So what I would say to our students is, look, what you're, what you're witnessing here is something you're going to have to get used to at university, which is, OK, there might be less presence of tutors to an extent, but it's about how you manage your time. It's about your motivation to get onto our online um, courses, to get onto our virtual learning site and how you um, complete those tasks. So it's about really being organised with your time and plan things.